happy Sunday. So I just got dressed, wearing my coat because it's cold here. I'm getting in an elevator. Also, this elevator is so small, but I'm about to meet one of my professors who's here on sabbatical. I met up with her like early October, but she's gonna leave in a few weeks. So I'm meeting up with her one last time before he goes. And then I lost one of my keychains, so I might go buy another one before I leave Taipei. And then I'm probably gonna head back home after that. So I don't really know what's in store, so we'll see, but as always, I'm taking y'all along with me. So I'm gonna go up to lunch and I'll see you all later. So we ended up going to the S Light Cafe. There are lots of S Light buildings and I had this apple pizza thing. It tasted really good. And then I got on the bus and I headed home. Hey y'all, I am back. Um, so I fell asleep on the bus. Like I usually fall asleep on the bus except I always worry that I'm gonna like sleep and miss my stop, which happened to me only once. I didn't miss my stop, but my friend was riding the bus with me, and so she like woke me up like right when we got there. But anyways, lunch was really fun. We got to catch up, and then we wandered in the building that we were eating at. It's like a huge department store, which there are tons of department stores in Taipei, and they have a bunch of different. They're kind of like just malls. They're like giant malls, like with tens of floors and they have restaurants scattered throughout um and they had a lot of christmasy stuff up and then i went to go run my errands like i said i went to hua Shan creative park which has a lot of really nice stores nice pop-up stores i bought some stuff in here and you can see this is a panda so i bought something with a panda on it um and then i just came home and now it's kind of rainy outside but yeah, I definitely want to go back to sleep, but I know that if I go back to sleep, I'm not going to be able to wake up. Also, I don't know why my zoom, it was zoomed in so much. So I'm going to unpack my bag and I really do need to crochet. I need to finish those Christmas gifts. So I probably am going to do that the rest of the day, honestly. And I do need to edit my video from yesterday so that's probably what i'm going to be doing today till i go get dinner so i'm going to go unpack chill crotch it whatnot and i'll see you all for dinner as i was unpacking i just remembered sundays are also my chore days especially my laundry days so i have the dirty clothes from this weekend so i have to go do that which means all of these clothes will finally get put away because i need to make space the clothes i'm about to wash and i also usually try to vacuum my floors and sometimes i swear for them i try to do that at least once a week but vacuuming definitely i end up doing maybe more than once a week um but swiffering maybe once every other week it just depends how dirty my floors are but my hair gets everywhere on the floors like when i'm brushing it and when i wake up and in the morning so it, my hair is usually on the floor which is why i have to vacuum my floor because i have to pick it up so i also need to go do all of my chores today as well so as you can see sundays are pretty busy for me anyways i'm gonna go start my laundry do my vacuuming and then do what i mentioned before which was like crocheting and all that so yeah i'll now i should be back i actually you know what i'm not going to tell you when i'm going to be back because i don't even know when i'm going to be back but i will be back so i'll see you later guys i'm actually like crying right now i went to empty out my dehumidifier and the water spilled everywhere like look at this i don't know if you can tell but the water's everywhere i'm so upset so now i'm <laughs> trying to clean it up but it literally got everywhere uh i wasn't even like i was trying to be careful but i literally had just finished vacuuming like i put the vacuum away and i was like oh crap i need to empty my dehumidifier and now there's water everywhere you may go on my rug but this is very upsetting all right i'll be back okay i ended up cleaning everything up i went through all my paper towels so i need to get more but this piece was left in the machine sorry my batteries have been dying like crazy anyways this piece fell out of the machine so i'm gonna need to figure out where it goes i don't know if it goes in like one of these pieces or if it goes in the actual machine here's the machine 
it's still dripping a little bit. You can probably hear it. So yeah, I'm not 100% sure where this goes, but I'm going to put this back together. See, this goes like this. So I feel like this has to go inside one of these. This is like the only one that it fits in. I remember seeing it, like it looks right, like when I first got it. So I'm gonna hope this is right. Plug it back in. And on the bright side, it'll pick up all the leftover water. Ah, I can't believe this happened. But uh, at least I finished cleaning everything. My rug is still wet, but the dehumidifier hopefully help with that. It'll, it should soak up the water that's left on the floor. I'm going to finish doing all my chores and yeah, that was a fun adventure. Oh my gosh. But all right, I'm gonna go and hope there's no more surprises today. All right, everyone, I am back for the night. It's been a few hours now, but I went to dinner. We got dinner at this hibachi place, which we recently discovered and it was really good. And then we had to run some errands. I bought some more paper towels because of the little incident from earlier. Um, and then I just got my laundry, so I'm going to hang up my laundry and <laughs> do some editing and then crochet. I did end up changing the project because everything I was doing wasn't making sense. It wasn't working out. So yeah, I'm gonna do all that. I have to take a shower and go to bed. So I'm going to sign off for the night, but I'll see you all tomorrow morning. Bye.